you guys! Oh, Welcome okay. to my channel. It's me and Gigi, and we're here to do a favorites video. Hope you guys enjoy, and we're gonna get started. Okay, so let's get started. I'm gonna start off with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. It's three contour shades and three highlight shades. Um, I have only been using the um, Havana, which is this one here, and then I've been using Banana for the under the eye to set my concealer and it is just amazing it retails for forty dollars and i think it's super worth it i mean forty dollars you get six uh shades and i just been definitely liking this so the next favorite has been this maybelline nude palette this one here has about 12 shades uh it has matte shades and shimmery shades the colors are just amazing for everyday use um and i just i just love the pigmentation um it's not bad as you can see these are my favorite three colors so it, it's it's amazing i really really have enjoyed this so now that we're talking about eyeshadows and we're in the eyeshadow mood this palette has been one of my favorites it's a chocolate bar uh, palette the original one i know that there's a new one that came out haven't had my chance to buy it but i'm definitely going to check it out and it's very very uh, versatile and the one that i've been loving as you can see see this month or the past two months has been this transitional color here it's just an amazing peachy kind of transitional color that I've been loving and uh, it has to be one of my favorites it's just very neutral very versatile and like I said this transitional color has been one of my favorite transitional colors of all uh, time. another thing that I've been loving is this Milani eyeshadow this Milani eyeshadow I really 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 like it it's the only one I have at the moment but I'm planning to get more just because I just love the packaging for I think it retails for about three something three dollars and the packaging is just an amazing packaging gold packaging um, and I, this one here is called Bea, Bea Bronze 24 and this one here I've just been loving for the crease or for the outer corner and it's just a brownsy, uh, brown browns color it's just a very nice color very metallic I think this is yeah it's a metallic finish and I just love it for the inner corner I mean the outer corner um, and it's just an amazing uh, color that I've just been enjoying a lot. Two other things from Milani have been these limited edition lipsticks. They're the matte lipsticks. And then this one is Enchanted Ruby and Enchanted Topaz. Enchanted Topaz, I think it's a dupe for a MAC. Uh, um, a MAC lipstick. And as you can see, they're super pigmented. They're matte. Uh, this one I love for everyday use. Um, and it just goes very well with any eye color any makeup uh color you have it goes with everything and i just love it i love the packaging as well i think they retail for about six dollars i'm not sure if you can find these uh, anywhere now but it's just one of my favorites as well as enchanted ruby enchanted ruby i heard was another dupe for uh something else i think from mac another lipstick but i'm not sure which one and uh, as you can see, it's a very deep like red. I just love it, cranberry red. And they're super pigmented, super matte, and I really, really have enjoyed these. The lipstick has been this NYX uh, Soft Matte Lip Cream. And this one here is called Stock Stockholm. I think it's Stockton. I'll put the name right here. can't even pronounce it. Um, it's super a neutral color as well for everyday use. It's like a peachy kind of neutral color. It's right here. And that's what I'm wearing right now with a little bit of like a hint of lip gloss. And it's amazing. I really, really like it. I bought this a long time ago and I didn't really pay attention to it. It's the Milani Big Bronzer in the color Soleil uh, 5. And this is how it looks like. It has a lot of shimmer in there. Uh, I wouldn't use it as a bronzer, uh, but I, I don't really use it as a bronzer, but I do use it as kind of like a hint of highlight, and it is amazing. I'm wearing it right now. I'm not sure if you guys can see it, or yeah, yeah I'm wearing it right now. And just I'm just amazed with it, how well it goes with my skin tone, and I've just been loving it a lot as well. Another thing for my pores that I've been using has this Bior Free Your Pores. Uh, acne clearing clearing scrub and this is basically it clears and polishes without damaging skin um, and as you guys know but Bior I think it's called Bior usually it's very good with pores they have the pore strips they have things like this to minimize the appearance of pores or clean them out 
um, and I got this one this one is amazing it gives you a cool feeling it leaves you very refreshing and it gives you that feeling that your face is 100% clean and it, it's super well it has that orangey smell and that brings me to the, my next favorite which is the Ponds cucumber cleansing fresh and light cleanser and makeup remover so what I use is I you basically get like a wipey grab the wipey take everything out and all your makeup, makeup is basically off then I go in with my Olay brush or cleansing um, system and then I use this with it and I just work this around with my face with that clearing system and I'm good to go and the last few things that I have here are basically uh, random this one here is the Garnier for Tease uh, deconstructed texture tease dry touch finishing spray this I heard from Tati I think I, I showed you guys in one of my haul videos I think about this um, and this I really really like because it kind of reminds me for um, about the big head the big tease uh, product that I showed you guys in one of my videos this is exactly the same it has uh, it's less pricey I think it's only five bucks the other one's like 20 and this one here actually like helps me tease my hair so big and fluffy so nice and just helps me a lot I heard this from Tati um, like I said I'm like a super fan of her channel and um, I heard it from her and I, I really have enjoyed this I'm almost out of it but it is an amazing product I'm gonna definitely purchase more of these okay so another thing I wanted to share with you guys has been my favorite foundation of the month or probably two months already honestly it's one of my favorites that I've been wearing every single day it doesn't matter if I go out it doesn't matter if I'm gonna go to work it has to be the foundation that I have to wear it is just an amazing it's just an amazing foundation it's a full coverage and it's drugstore which is always amazing this is a flower cosmetics foundation I have a first impression um, slash review on this foundation and um, I'm probably already halfway uh, after these two months I'm perfect for my skin tone um, to go out it is just an amazing full coverage foundation okay so the last two things that I wanted to show you were uh, two brushes that I've been loving these are my favorite two brushes that I have to use every time I do my eye makeup the first one is the Sonia Kashuk the blending brush this is what I used for my transitional color and this is what I used to basically basically blend everything out I just been loving it loving it a lot it's a very fluffy brush and if you guys see all my current videos I probably have been using this every time I do my eye makeup I have to use this for my trans transitional color or to blend everything out and then the next one has been the elf brush the uh, blending eye brush this is only a buck I think a buck or three bucks I think I think only a dollar time I use uh, eyeshadow in the outer corner I use this for the crease or for the outer corner just to create uh, basically carve it out since I have like a very small eyes and very um, hooded eyes this helps me like get into my crease and carve it out so I it doesn't look my eyes don't look that hooded and it kind of helps me open them not open them but have that appearance of me having a little bigger eyes than usual so I've been loving this a lot and uh, so yeah that's about it guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video I know that it was all random stuff but those are my favorites I'll see you guys in the next time bye